Morning guys, it's James from Advanced In Car Tech. Today, well, the last couple of days, we've been working on this brand new Volkswagen T6 Transporter and done quite a bespoke installation for uh, this particular customer. So come on round, what we've done is we've fitted a 13.3 inch drop down DVD roof mounted monitor system. Uh, we've also then teamed it up with a kicker two channel amplifier that sits underneath the front seats of the vehicle. Just excuse the beeping, it's just because the ignition's on. So you might be able to see that with the camera. Light's probably not amazing, but we've teamed that up with the two-channel kicker amplifier. We've got the 13.3 drop-down DVD screen with HDMI. Now this HDMI on the side currently has our PlayStation plugged in because we are in the workshop. So we are plugged into the mains and we are, have got a wireless uh, network set up for the Wi-Fi. Now, normally we would use our Chromecast or our Fire Stick. You've got USB control on the side next to it for power. You can then, depending on your data on your phone or if you're in a Wi-Fi area, you can then stream straight to the DVD player. And what we've done is teamed it up with the audio out Rather than using the internal speakers, which are normally a little bit tinny on these systems, we've used an audio out. So I don't know if Tim can show you, but on the dashboard here, we have fitted an independent volume gain control. The reason why we've done this is because if you've got young children, you don't want to have to start keep pulling over and using the remote control, which on a lot of these systems is a bit cheap and nasty and got too many buttons. So what we've done is we've done this nice little gain control here. It looks smart, does the job, and it gives you just the right sound quality that you need for the back. So going back to the back here. Um, not everybody would have a PlayStation 3 plugged into their vehicle. The reason why I said we've done this is just to make it easy for what we want to show. Now, we've got a DVD in at a moment, not everyone's cup of tea, so I'm just going to press play. And I'm going to turn up the volume. Now, due to DVD formats and how they're recorded, this particular one, although it's widescreen, is not using the full um, picture quality or the full screen size. So I can press zoom and I can go in and use the full screen and you've got quite a few extra functions there. So I just go back to zoom off. Right, so now as Tim's recording, I'm just gonna go to the front and turn up the volume control knob. So as you were here, was the biggest major violator in Los Angeles. Okay, so just turn that back down. Now, at the same time, so you're in the middle of watching a DVD, you now want to watch PlayStation. So on the actual DVD player itself, there's a control or you can use the remote. So I can hit that. What we can do is we can now switch between the DVD player and the source of the PlayStation. Okay, so we've got Netflix. So using the PlayStation controller, we can scroll through and choose whatever film we want. Of course, you can download stuff to watch, but you will need good data connection on your phone. So let's just press play. Uh, resume playing, so just press play on there. Providing you've got decent Wi-Fi connection, that will load up. And then, so make sure there's no swearing for YouTube. I'm just gonna turn up the volume a tiny bit. No, I love my mum. Yeah, I love his mum. Hey. Okay, so that's the volume control. I am being careful there. We do want to show off the system because with the Kicker 2 channel amplifier, we have also teamed it up with a set of coaxial Alpine rear speakers. They're two-way speakers. They're connected into the back of the door cards here with spacer rings. And then this van is going to get all carpeted and it's going to look absolutely fantastic. Um, the speakers above, if you have noticed them, that's for a completely different intercom type system for the front driver to speak to the kids in the back. So that's the, the reason why we've done this. So going back to the DVD player, um, again, 13.3 built-in DVD player, HDMI on the side, USB on the side, and an audio out. And that's the reason why we've teamed it up with this beautiful amplifier under the seat. If you've got a bus like this, or a van, or a camp conversion, and you want something that's as good as this, get in touch with us. It's www.advanced-incar.co.uk. We're Advanced In Car Technologies. Thanks for watching.